WCYB TV5 brings you daily devotions with Lester McKinnon of Fellowship Chapel, Bristol, Virginia. 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 6. I am now ready to be offered, and the time of my departure is at hand. You know, it's one thing to say I'm ready for heaven, meaning that your sins are forgiven and heaven is your home. It is quite another to say I'm ready for heaven, meaning that you want to go at this very present moment. There are not too many Christians who feel that way. Many years ago, an evangelist asked all who wanted to go to heaven to raise their hands in the congregation. <clears throat> Excuse me. Everyone in the congregation did so except one elderly man seated near the front of the auditorium. The preacher pointed his finger at him and said, Sir, do you mean to tell us that you don't want to go to heaven? Sure, I want to go to heaven, the nonconformist replied. But the way you put the question, I figured you were getting up a busload tonight. I'm not ready to go at this very present moment. You know, some Christians aren't eager to leave this world because they're involved in the pursuits of everything that, has, that it has to offer. The Bible indicates, however, that there is, just, there is justifiable reason for not wanting the bus to leave this very present moment. In the book of Philippians, chapter 1, verse 21, the apostle Paul said that he, belonged, that he longed to be with Christ. He wrote, For me to live is Christ and to die is gain. And in verse 23 he added, For I am in a strait betwixt two, desiring to depart and to be with Christ which is far better. Coupled with his longing to go was a reluctance to go immediately, not because he had unconfessed sin or he was tied to the things of this world, but because his brothers and sisters in the Lord needed his spiritual ministry. And we who have trusted Christ and are surrendered to him, we should also have the attitude that was possessed by the Apostle Paul. May we too be ready to stay, but also ready to go. Only those who are ready to die are ready to live. The hymn writer penned the words, ready to stay, ready to go, ready in my place to fill, ready in life, ready in death, ready to do his will. Once again, 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 6, I am now ready to be offered and the time of my departure is at hand. One of these days the trump of God will sound. The voice of the archangel will be heard. Now we know there's a bright and a glorious home away in the heavens high, but will you be there and I? Think of this today and God bless you. Join us again at the same time tomorrow for another daily devotion. This is WCYB-TV, Channel 5 in Bristol, serving Bristol, Kingsport, Johnson City, and the Phi State area. WCYB-TV is owned and operated by Appalachian Broadcasting Corporation, a subsidiary of Lamco Communications Incorporated. WCYB-TV studios and general offices are at Cumberland and Lee Streets, Bristol, Virginia. The studio transmitter links KIS-44 and KCS-8909 operate on frequencies 6,987.5 and 6,912.5 megahertz. WCYB-TV operates at maximum power 83.2 kilowatts visual, 11.5 kilowatts oral. The transmitter is located at Rye Patch Knob on Holston Mountain in Cherokee National Forest with an antenna 2,230 feet above average terrain. Some of our programs during the day were on film and videotape. This is Steve Taylor speaking for the staff and management of WCYB-TV, wishing you a very pleasant good night and good morning. Ladies and gentlemen, our national anthem. Mm -hmm.